What's up everyone? It's Tim from Tim Plays Game here with a normal lost phone. Very cool uh, um, indie game when I showed off tonight. You have just found a phone. Find out the truth. This is a new genre of games actually. It's well, not relatively new. It's uh, where you basically, the premise is you find a phone, you have to figure out what happened to the person it belonged to. Oh, and we got four new messages from Dad. Alright. So let's, uh, let's start off with see I have a new phone number I have new uh, phones now you have my new number Sam okay I'm guessing the guy who owns the phone is named Sam so we already have our first clue <laughs> all right why are you texting me from your bedroom dad I just sent my new number to all my contacts it was it wasn't just for you why are you replying <laughs> from your bedroom dad are you kidding me me never ha huh, dad Okay, yeah, he's one of those fun dads. I love that. Okay, so we got. So let's see. Now the date in, on this game is really weird. It goes well. It's not really weird. It's unusual for uh, America standards. It goes day, then month, then year, which is how most of the world does it. So this uh, first message came in on December first. So now it's December twelfth. No, it's December twenty-first. Happy birthday, Dad. Thank you, Dad. <laughs> So that was so his birth his dad's birthday is December twenty first. Mom wants to know if Melissa will dine with us tonight, Dad. No, we've not been getting along recently. Ooh, okay. Some trouble here. Be strong, son. Women are complicated sometimes. Your mother's still a complete mystery to me, Dad. Men can be complicated too sometimes. To can be complicated sometimes too, sorry. You're a brave, you're a brave boy. Melissa's a good girl. She'll come back soon. Trust me, Dad. Okay, so January 15th. So that took place on January 9th. Uh, we got January 15th. I can't connect to my emails anymore. You'll have to help me when you're back. Okay, so I guess he was away on January 15th. January 18th. Mom would like to know if Melissa could send her chocolate cake recipe she made for my birthday, Dad. January 21st, 22nd, sorry. Mom told me to remind you about your dentist appointment today. Did you mess did you get my message about the dentist? Why aren't you answering, Dad? I saw I saw that. I was in class, sorry. Okay. That was on January 22nd. January 29th. Your mom made an appointment at the hairdresser for you at 10 a.m. tomorrow. What? But I've already told you a million times that I don't want to cut my I don't want to get my hair cut. Make an effort. It'll make it'll make your mom happy, Dad. And then that was that was on the 29th. Then the next day, the 30th, I'm picking up groceries for tomorrow's party. I wonder how many people will, will be there. Is Melissa planning on coming, Dad? She's not coming. Ooh. How come? She seems to be the perfect girl for a guy like you. Mom and I thought she was very. She was very nice, polite, well-behaved, and pretty, just what what every man's looking for in a wife. I really don't want to talk about it. Oh boy. You never seem to pay much attention to girls in general. We thought you were really into Melissa. We thought you were good together. What happened? Stop. Okay, wow. Happy birthday, son. I'm so proud of the man you've become. We'll celebrate properly tonight and be prepared for a big party for your 18th, Dad. Thanks, Dad. Okay, so that was at 10.30, that was in the morning. So now we're at uh, January 31st at 8.15 p.m. Where are you? Everyone's looking for you. Samuel, where are you? Where'd you go, Dad? We're really worried. Tell us everything is fine. Your mom wants to call the police, Dad. Oh, wow. So that was like five minutes ago, wow. Yeah, like five minutes ago, apparently. Okay, let's, uh, let's call him. Oh, no insufficient credit. I can't call. Okay. That's weird. I guess this is like one of those pay-as-you-go phones. Good lord, this guy ever- who does- this guy has so many people to text to! Ugh. Well, we're gonna go through all these messages. I think that's gotta be the first thing we gotta do. Figure out what's going on. Sophie Board Games. I have a new number. Okay, Sophie Board Games. This happened on the December 13th. Are you still at, are you still at the club? I think I forgot my umbrella. I left already, but Alice was staying longer. I'll ask her. 
She got it already. Thank you. Cool. No problem. I thought it was weird that she didn't leave at the same time as you. I thought you were always went home together. You, you've been inseparable recently. She's my best friend. Happy birthday, Sam. I hope this. I hope the cake is great and you get a lot of presents, Sophie. Okay, not much there. Let's see, Uncle Raymond. Nah. Let's see, you got a new phone number. Nice. Which one was it expensive? How much could you get from your old dad? Hope you got a very cool one. Not so expensive. I don't need a great phone anyway. Plus, Xmas is around the corner, and then my birthday. So, he promised to make history with my gift. Ooh. Don't know what he's got in mind. That was a, that was at the. So his birthday is on the 31st, I believe. Yeah, January 31st, and that's what day it is right now. I'm looking at the top of the phone. 10:05 p.m. Okay. So apparently something happened with the birthday gift. I don't know. So he promised to make history with my gift. Then don't know what he's got in mind. Ha! Huh. Is he already dropping hints? I've already I've got the, a slight idea. Ho ho ho! But I won't say a word. All I can say is it's not suitable for little girls. Ha 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 ha! <coughs> Sorry, got a cold. Happy 2016 from Ray. 2016. Wow. Okay. I think this uh, game's a little old. Well, it just recently came to the Switch on Mar in March. All right. Hey, big boy. I get to see you this ni this the next weekend. Yeah. Hi, Uncle Ray. Tio already told me. See you soon. Tio, I guess. Guess T if if Ray's his uncle, the Tio must be his cousin. Dumb Tio doesn't know Merlin's Wi-Fi password. We need internet. I'll just send it to him. Aha, thank you. We're almost there. Be a good boy and go tell your mom. You're 18. Woo-ha! Woo-ha! Party, 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 party! See you later. Oh, I forgot. Cake, 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 cake. Well, this tries to be tries way too hard to be one of those cool uncles. Okay, uh, this is Salem from school. Uh, I missed part of English of, Eng of today's English class. Can I copy your notes next Monday? Sure, I owe you one. I'll make the copy for you today. No worries. Man, you're already 18. Not fair. Still 10 months to go for me. Happy birthday. Alright, just gotta go through this stuff, guys. We'll get through it. <laughs> this is Miriam. Noah told... Okay, this is on the... Wow, this is on the 1st of... No, the 7th of January. No, told me you might not be interested in video. You might be interested in video games. What? He's the one who's interested. He is obsessed. I love, but told me you talked about it the other day, and I wanted to ask you if you like to try. Maybe try what? Do you know what a game jam is? Like playing games all together? Not sure. Almost. It's an event where people get together and try to develop a game prototype in a limited time. It's mostly just fun, creative, interesting. And you often get to meet cool people and learn new things. Sounds cool, but I really don't know what I can do. Music. Noah said you uh, you are a great musician. Really? Are you? Are there also people making music there? Of course. Sound and music are super important. It's like a challenge to develop something in those conditions. It's mostly the, it's mostly for the fun, really. But if it is a good but if it is good, who knows what will happen afterwards? And in any case, the experience. And the experience and the new friends is the most valuable thing you'll get from it. Anyway, you could make us some cool music compositions for the harp. Tell the truth, while I play the harp, I actually prefer composing for other instruments. Okay, so he plays the harp. So, uh, Sam plays the harp, and he's very into music. I'll try to make a note of that. Do you... Do what you want. So are you still coming? I don't know, maybe I'll try. When is it? There are a bunch, but the best one is the last weekend of January. Will you join us, please? But Sunday is my birthday. Ah, oh, I didn't know. Sorry. Don't be. There will be more. I'll keep that in mind. Thank you for... Thanks for thinking of me. Sure, musicians are always welcome. And then on 31st, I don't... I didn't forget your birthday. Happy birthday from the game with the Game Jam. We're about to present our game. Okay, that's cool. So, uh, I think she talked about a guy named Noah. Let's see if he's on here. Noah's school, okay. Got a new phone, Noah. The talk about the, univer the talk about university today was so cool, wasn't it? Yes, it helps it yes, it helps us understand everything a bit better and help make the big decision. So that's that was this was in December. December seventeenth. I've already decided anyway. I want to study something cool, video games. What about you? That's great. I'm not surprised you're always talking about games. I have some friends who know a lot and have done cool stuff. I'm jealous now. Like what? They call, they're call they called 
Atelier 801 and they make this cool game called Transform Ice. Man, they're awesome, but what about you? You didn't look very convinced in the talk. I don't know yet, I'm undecided. You're a cool musician, why not compose for games? Maybe. Uh, you don't sound very confident, you convinced, either. It's a cool industry, think about it, I will, I promise. Happy birthday, Mr. Boring Adult. <laughs> So not much going on there. Let's see. We were at Miriam last. Oh, Hugo. Uh, you think the family wants to be more revealing, but I guess not. <coughs> um, Happy New Year. I hope you had a great time last night. This was on January first. We had some fun here with your mom, with your dad and mom. Did they show you the photos? See you for your birthday, big boy. <laughs> Thank you, Uncle Hugo. They're still sleeping. Glad to hear you're. Good. You had a good start to the new year. Then on 31st, happy birthday. I don't know if I can come. Always the same. Sorry. Okay, then there's Tim Nanamaker. Nanamaker. Tim Nanamaker. What did I miss today in class? Not much, but she said we'll have an exam before the end of the next month. <clears throat> what? Okay. Try not, I'll try not to swear too much in this video, but uh, there was a lot of cursing. We had one last week. What a... You know what? Happy birthday, okay. We gotta get to the, we'll get to the good stuff eventually. The good stuff eventually is the Antistel. Dear Sam, to get Diane Elizabeth Rocky on, I wish you a happy birthday. We hope you achieve all your goals in life and live happily ever after. Cool. Leo Accordion. I'm sure, Accordion is not his last name. <laughs> Sam, sorry I know a couple. Sorry, I know a couple. Sam, oh, uh, Sam, okay, he's wondering which Sam it is. Sam from the music school or Sam from the lab? Sorry, the one from school. Okay, happy birthday. Chloe, board games. I have a new phone. Okay. Is everything okay, Sam? Hi, Chloe. Yes, why? Just wondering because you seemed upset the other day when you uh, left after talking to Lola. Ooh. <coughs> this was back in December. <laughs> and you weren't there today. Yeah, no worries. I'll be around at some point. If you don't want to stay long, at least bring one of your mom's cakes. Half of the people will go there just for the cake. <laughs> it won't be the same without you there. Hey, hey, is that all you care about? The cakes? Open mouth emoji. I'm joking. We'll just... Well, just a bit. I was worried about you, too. I don't like Lola, either. Just don't talk to, the, to her, then. I usually don't anyway, but... Okay, okay, hope to see you soon. Thanks for asking, have a good day. Happy 18th birthday, Sam. Let's see, is Lola on here? There's Lulu. Oh, Lola board games, here we go. Oh, wow. <coughs> hey, could you bring that game from last week? Can't remember the name of the one with mice. Transform mice, oh my god, okay. Okay. Your mom cakes are so good, she's so nice to bake them for us every time. Okay, thanks, I'll tell her. That was back in um, on December 6th, and then this is a week later, December 13th. You truly are a monster. I'm so disgusted that I've discovered your true face today. Don't ever set foot back in this club or I'll have to tell your little secret to everybody. Whoa. Drama bomb. No, okay. <laughs> That was a kind of a, that's kind of a turnaround. It's like, oh, we're all friends. Next week, you're a monster. Okay, well. Friendly. <laughs> Let's see, where were we? Uh... Crap, where were we? I think Chloe board games and Esteban board games. Guess there's like a board game club. Okay, this is from Fabrina Petrova. When is your next concert? Ooh, okay, so there's a concert called to uh, Sam Bolt's concert. Hey, Fabrina had one in June and you missed it. Smells from this. I know, I'm very sorry, Fleeky Brown Face. I couldn't find a babysitter for the twins and they. <coughs> they're still too young to stay alone. Why don't you just leave Gerald to look after them and come on your own? I would have done so gladly, but Gerald wasn't in 
Melrin that evening. So Melrin, I guess, is where they live, the city. It's kind of weird. I just, it took a while for you to put that together. And you should have come with the twins. I'd love to see them again. LOL. Double exclamation mark. You don't know what you're saying. They're so mischievous. Double exclamation mark. But you're invited to invi you're invited to visit us anytime, anytime you like. Of course, single exclamation mark. I will, and maybe, and maybe I might even throw you a private concert for the four of you. Sticking tongue out. Emoji. That would be awesome. Then you're invited to dinner too. Front, smiley face with a nose. I just hope to see you before you come to before you become too famous, and we have to pay to see you play winky front smiley face with a nose. Why did they put a nose on emojis? So unnecessary. <laughs> <laughs> the nose is implied. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> I take the I take that as a compliment, cat face. But seriously, let me know next time, please. I will, no worries. Thank you, and send hugs to your mom and dad. Beautiful day for turn 18. Uh, okay, have fun. So he turned 18, so he's an adult now. Yeah, happy 18th birthday, happy birthday, happy birthday. Okay. Thomas Board Games. Hey, where have you been lately? Will you come today? This is on the 20th of December. This is a week after the whole, uh, Lola debacle. Hey, Tom, I'm not sure, but have fun anyway. My phone says it's your birthday. Okay, so this is so... Yeah, I guess Lola started blackmailing him or something. And Sam stopped coming to the board game club or whatever it is. My phone says it's your birthday. Happy birthday. Okay. And then David... <laughs> I have a new number. Okay, my cousin Tio is coming on is coming on Saturday to watch a race here. You're welcome to join us. We'll get pizza. I can't. I'm grounded for the whole weekend. That was back in. Okay, that was January 18th. Too bad. You can borrow some games from me if you want. Let me know. Happy birthday. Blinking annoying. I'm vi I'm missing your party. Make it a good one. Okay. David, not much there. Then I think we, I think we already talked to Noah already. Yeah, we already talked to, we already, uh, to Mrs. Dupont. Mrs. Dupont, Sam, will you be away next weekend? Could you feed Ringo again? He really likes you. Thank you. Hello, Mrs. Dupont. No problem. I'll do it. I like him a lot too. You'll find the food in the cupboard on the left, and a little surprise for you. Don't tell your mum. Winky smiley face. Thank you very much, but it's really not necessary. It's my pleasure. Uh, okay, so that was back in December 3rd. Have a great start. Have a great start to the new year and lots of love from the three of us, darling. Well, thank you, likewise. That was on December 31st, and then January 31st is the next time they speak a month later. I wish you a very happy birthday, young man! Okay, I can't call. Oh, wow, there's all this stuff, too. Okay. Well, let's go through the messages since we've already, like, half- we're probably, like, already halfway through. Uh, okay, there we go. It's weird to get around. I think this game was originally made for cell phones, or... Yeah, and I guess they, uh, ported it to the Nintendo Switch, which was a cool idea. Because you can actually play it by turning the Switch, uh... Vertically. To return it, or, yeah, just... Ah, <coughs> God, okay. Let's see. Oh, Mom, here we go. This should be revealing. Because every good boy shares their secrets with their mom. I've made you a chocolate cake for your book club. Mom, thank you, you're the best. I've made an apple pie for your board game club. Okay. I've got the world's best mom. So apparently uh, Sam was in a book club and a board game club. Which he stopped going to in December, sometime mid-December, I believe. I made lemon pie for your book club, Mom. You're awesome. They all love you. That was December 9th. December 13th. I prepared banana bread for your board game club, Mom. Yum, my favorite. Then December 16th. I made strawberry pie for your book club. So we have... Wait, wait, wait. It doesn't add up. We got book club, board game club... Bo book club, board game club... Okay, yeah, sorry. I thought it was board game club three times. Made strawberry pie for your book club, Mom. My friends, my friends will end up fat because of you, Mom, but thanks. After the club, we're going to a book festival on the 19th. 
It's a bit far and we, and we might need to eat on the train. I'd rather not eat those overpriced train sandwiches, so could you make something I love you, Mom? <laughs> could you make me free food? Thanks, Mom. Love you. Okay. Of course, I'll pack, I'll pack meals for your trip. I'm happy to know you're making new friends, Mom. Thanks, Mom. Is Melissa going with you too? No, no, she doesn't really like these things. Ooh. Oh, pity, she's the perfect girl for you. She'll make you very happy, I'm sure. <coughs> okay. December 16th, that whole conversation happened. Something else that, uh, let's see, there's a book festival on the 19th. That's next week from this. Book festival, that doesn't book festival like, this is just a festival for reading it's, it's, that doesn't seem like a festival at all all right well I'll, let's just uh, keep going so I'm preparing <coughs> I packed lunches for your book festival tomorrow and a cake for your board game club on Sunday what kind of cake do you want no cakes for Sunday I think it's time I stopped going to the board game club because Lola blackmailed him oh but I thought you liked it less and less besides they didn't appreciate your cakes enough oh how dare they not appreciate a mother's cakes? Mom, don't worry, but I missed the last train home. I'll stay at the book festival one more day. A friend of mine is letting me stay, okay? As long as you're home for your dad's birthday. Okay, so I guess, uh, the birthday- I guess his dad's birthday is on the 20th? Oh, okay, no, it's on the 21st. Don't forget to wish your dad a happy birthday, Mom. So yeah, 1221, that's, uh, his dad's birthday. Not sure if that's important or not. <coughs> Uncle Hugo invited us to celebrate New Year's at his place, Mom. Oh, pity, I've already made plans to be, to be with Melissa. That was on the 23rd of December. Oh, no, that's on the... That technically would be on the 31st. It's New Year's. I'm sure he would love to meet your girlfriend. You can invite her. She'll be back from her holidays and probably tired. It's not a good idea. As you wish, but dad, but dad and me are definitely going. Let Hugo know if you change your mind. Okay, Mom, sure. So, do I bake a cake for the book club, or do they not like them anymore, Mom? They love your cakes, but they take a break in January. They take a break in January? What the heck? Book club? What kind of boring teenager is this? I'm sorry, man. <laughs> book club at 17? Are you kidding me? Last thing I was doing at 17 was reading. <laughs> Probably why I do this for a living. <laughs> You're not bringing cakes from Melissa now, are you? She's good, but not as good as me. No, I'm bring. I'm not bringing anything from Melissa. Ooh, that was on the first of January. Oh no, the fifth of January. <clears throat> Happy birthday to my lovely son, mom. Okay, wow, we have covered a lot. Not really getting into any detail, and we still got a couple other messages to go. But that's gonna wrap things up for this video, everyone. Uh, we'll get through the messages later on. Let's see, we're at Mom. Oh, there's Melissa. Yeah, we can, that, that's gonna be a good one. And then another board games, uh, board games guy. There's Tio. There's okay. So yeah, we're gonna get to that next time, guys. So that's gonna wrap things up for this video. Thank you all so much for watching. Make sure you like this video, subscribe to Tim Plays a Game, and stay tuned for more videos from a lost, a found phone. What is the name of this game? A found phone. I, I, I'm sorry. I. I just kind of, kind of blanking on the name of the game, but uh, yeah. Uh, Till then, this is Tim from Tim Plays Games signing off, and have a good night.